<laughs> good day, good day. How the hunk are you? Welcome to Roverland. Yeah, this is your friend Dano, and this is the channel that's anything and everything Land Rovers. And yes, you're uh, seeing a horde of Land Rovers out there today. Today, we are going to be talking about Zamax. Yes, and uh, kind of my um, collection. Yeah, I've been kind of hemming and hawing and talking about this. Uh, actually, we're going to take this out of the package. Uh, where did I put my knife? Hold on. I'm surprised I did that without uh, tagging the camera. All right, I'm going to take this one out. i got to put it over here so I can uh, get it off from the counter there and get my big fat hands in the way. All right, so Zamax, that is a Walmart exclusive. This is from 2020. Um, yeah, this is number three. I just picked up a few of these. And, uh, you know, in my uh, loose collection, I didn't have one. So this one uh, we opened up. This was uh, one of the boogered up uh, cards. So we, uh, no problem opening this up. Well, we're going to put this down for a minute because we're going to go in chronological order. This... Ladies and gentlemen, is the first Zamax. Yeah, did that did that shine in your fine eyes? This was the first Zamax edition uh, of a Land Rover. Yes, and this is the 2015 Land Rover Defender Double Cab, uh, 2017. Now this came out, I believe, 20. 19? Oh boy, did I look that up before I flicked on the camera? No, I didn't! But anyway, this was, um, I believe the last time that we saw this bottle was in Zamax and uh, Walmart exclusive. So what the deal is, Mattel, or Hot Wheels, has... Um, a program, I guess you would say, or a deal with Walmart to do an exclusive uh, Zamax. So what this is, is this is a car, and, and there's no real, I, I don't know, and maybe you know. Down, comment down below once, once you hit the big thumbs up. What the um, criteria is for a model to be Zamax. But what it is, is normally there's no paint on it. It is bare metal. And we're going to see that uh, here in a second. But it'll usually have the graphics that are from that series. So they will have uh, graphics. They won't be like this where it's just bare metal. So um, I, I have got a uh, start <laughs> to a collection I would like to uh, make a uh, Zamax collection of every Land Rover model uh, that I uh, that's out there into a polished um, Zamax like this all right so here you go you can tell so this is uh, one of them that uh, I did now I, I did a wheel swap on this so the wheels look a little bit small, but I really like these wheels. Boy, we are really having a hard time focusing. Um, but yeah, so that uh, you can see that it's uh, they they treat them somehow. Uh, I re really don't know um, how they treat them, but they're they're not really per se bare metal, but they are. <laughs> so the other thing too I want to say is. Uh, that uh, when you when you do this, uh, you need to put some protective on it. Now this one, I uh, took the paint off, I paint strip them, and uh, then I uh, try to polish them. I'll, I'll uh, polish them. Now some of them uh, come out, it, it takes some time to do. So this one here, is, I, I just paint stripped, and uh, I really didn't spend a lot of time polishing. There's uh, like a four step, uh, polishing process to really help it shine. If you don't put any protective on these, they do tarnish a little bit and they get this kind of a look here. This one has uh, been sitting on the shelf unprotected, so it's kind of tarnished and uh, not as brilliant as this one here. 
but I didn't polish this all the way up. So that was the first one uh, that we've had uh, from uh, Zamax from Walmart. Um, so the second one, and I just picked up some of these, uh, was the, uh, the uh, Series 3, uh, the Land Rover Series 3 pickup. And this was the graphics that they had, the Baja Blazers with the uh, number 3 on there. Very, very nice, very nice. Yeah, flashy, flashy, flashy. You gotta love it. So the thing is with these is, uh, you know, there's people that collect Zamax, you know, the Hot Wheels Zamax. That's what their collection is. They, they do variations, uh, stuff like that. So uh, very, very cool, uh, you know, but hard to keep a collection of uh, because, uh, <laughs> yeah, people are swiping them. Yeah, swiping them. Uh, so anyway, uh, so that's a little bit of Hot Wheels. Here's another, well, here's another one. I think I showed you this one too. This is a current day, uh, Hot Wheels, the, uh, the, uh, Defender 90. Uh, yes. So that was, uh, one of, one that I made, uh, just recently, just, uh, it's not really polished too much either. I just kind of stripped the paint off and, uh, kind of buffed it up a little bit, but, uh, doesn't have the resilient shine. Uh, here's another Hot Wheels that I did. This is a long time ago. This is the original. I put steelies on this. They, they got such big wheel arches. So I tried to find a tire that would, uh, I did a little customizing there, a tire that would kind of fit those better, you know, those wheel arches. So that one there again uh, is just uh, stripped down, tan interior there. So uh, very, very cool. Uh, that's another Hot Wheels there. So, otherwise, um, the rest of them, I guess, are uh, Matchbox that, that I've done. Uh, except for a couple. Oh, well, let me show you this. Uh, this is a little Tootsie Toy. I did a video on one of these. Uh, this is a Tootsie Toy that is a Zamac. Yeah, so this is a standard, regular uh, Tootsie Toy. Uh, now, this one I did kind of polish up a little bit. Uh, the other, the video that I did, I cut out these windows, the back window and this back side window, which is a bear because there's those, those uh, wheel supports that come out and uh, yeah, that's heavy duty. The other one, and I'm, I'm still working on, these, uh, uh, they take a big tire and uh, this is another Tootsie Toy, the Land Rover. Uh, I really love this. I remember playing with these as a kid. So I uh, stripped this down but I haven't got any wheels on it yet. I'm trying to figure out, trying to get a good set of wheels that I could put on, on this one. So that was the other, that's the other uh, brand that I do have other than uh, Matchbox. So let's take a look at some of the uh, Matchbox. Now this one here, uh, I think, well, let's go with the first one. This one would be the first one. Now I don't have a luggage rack on this, but this one is the uh, Safari, the Land Rover Safari, uh, number 12. Uh, this one is polished and it's not treated at all. So eventually it will tarnish a little bit, but, uh, yeah, just kind of right and shiny. That's, that's more kind of goes with, uh, what the uh, original, uh, Zamax is like. So that is the, uh, Safari. And then I also have the, the, uh, fire tender, which this one is a busted base and everything on this one. Okay, I thought we were focusing very well today, but not, it was at 58, 57. The Land Rover Series 57. Uh, this one also is polished up pretty good. Nice, nice. Of course, the window is falling out of this one. I'm still working on uh, uh, finishing this, putting a ladder on it and stuff like that. But uh, once again, very, very nice. Um, so yeah, so that was Matchbox. I don't know, some of the older ones, uh, like this, this is, uh, very, very, uh, I think this is just barely paint stripped, uh, nothing on the, uh, old discovery here. Uh, yeah, very, very, um, rough shape as far as, uh, the, and this one too. Yeah. Just paint stripped. I like these green wheels. I was trying to find these green wheels. I don't know. What is it? Uh, what company has the chase vehicles with the green wheels? I kind of like those. Those are stock wheels from Matchbox. So, uh, so there's those. Uh, older one Matchbox would be this one here. This is uh, this is barely paint stripped, not very well. It's got the low profile tires on it. 
Uh, so yeah, it just kind of barely stripped this one. These are hard to polish because there's so many intricate parts and stuff. Even hard to get the paint out because they're so uh, hard to paint. Uh, here's a newer one that uh, I got. This one was not too bad. The, the newer metal uh, seems to shine up a little bit. So this is the latest uh, gen of the uh, Matchbox there. This one turned out very, very well. Now I got some real riders on this one. This is the SVX from Matchbox. I really like this casting. So I've really got big old honking wheels on this one. But uh, that one is really uh, polished up very, very nice. Uh, Freelander is another one that's really cool. I've got a couple of these that I polished up. This is just the plastic base on it. And uh, very, very cool. I really like that. This one polishes up pretty good. The other one is the is the newest one. Oh, uh, wheel fell off of that one. We better put that on there. Is the Evoke. And uh, yeah, I did a lot of work on these. I got quite a few of them. And I put the little bit different wheels on it. They come, usually come with these kind of, whoa, these kind of wheels. That one's coming apart. But uh, yeah, so this is barely painted, uh, barely paint stripped, and uh, not really polished. And then I did one that was polished. Look at the wheels on that one, huh? Yeah, these are Hot Wheels Real Riders. This is the 2015 Range Rover Evoke. So very, very cool. It got was able to polish this one up pretty, pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty snazzy there. And then of course I made uh, convertibles out of those Evokes. I have uh, styrene that I put over the back of these, uh, and this is kind of more or less the uh, the wheels that they come with. So uh, yeah, pretty cool. Uh, oh yeah, let's not forget this bad boy in the back. This is kind of the original uh, Defender for Matchbox. Well, the second generation, this is the, the solid, this is the latest release. I put the Matchbox wheels on here. Yeah, those are pretty awesome. Uh, I just tagged a little one on the hood and one in the back there just kind of stuck it on there. Didn't really uh, do uh, too much work to it, but uh, yeah, so there you go. That's some uh, Zamax there on the uh, Defender 90 for Matchbox. I also did a couple of other ones, put them back in the package. Yeah, I was trying to sell these, but you know, whatever, you know. But uh, this is, uh, yeah, this is the, the newer one. This is, uh, what is this from? Uh, 2016. So I got some black ones here. These uh, these are the Globetrotter, Globe traveler wheels here's some old uh red line or uh uh what is it <laughs> hot wheels yeah the uh real riders on there pretty cool pretty cool uh let's see i got a couple more oh yeah here's the ones this is uh so those are the orange ones this is the just blacked out took off the orange uh gray hubs on that one pretty pretty snazzy so yeah, I just try to do a little bit something. This one's really polished up. Look at those mag wheels. Yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool. Yeah, so there you go. Uh, that's uh, my Zamax collection. I need to keep working at it. I need to put more in here. Um, you know, I, um, I'm missing a few, obviously. <laughs> All right, well, it's almost uh, going on 15 minutes here and you've been wondering why this has been in the background. Well, uh, for all you that have been uh, sticking around at the end of my uh, videos, it's time. It's time. You know what time it is. And I put this, uh, I put this on. This is July 12th, 2021, and I put this on a packing list because, or on a packing paper because, uh, hello, yeah, that's because um, that is going to be the uh, one year, two years, excuse me, two years, two year anniversary of Roverland and we're going to do a boxing video. So I'm talking about that. Uh, I showed you last time a mini GT we're going to throw in there. We're going to throw in one of these. Yeah, the deluxe cars, the Land Rover um, Defender 110. We're going to throw one of those in the packs. So uh, yeah, so make sure you uh, thank you for sticking around till the end of the video. And uh, yeah, and check it out. Go on down to the comments below and let me know what you are looking for in your, uh, the prize box. Yeah, the two year, uh, 500, hopefully 500, uh, subscribers. Uh, that's it. I'm out of here. 15 minutes. Thank you for joining me.
Uh, this is your friend Dano. Remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rover day.